Good morning, time to kickstart the day with some energy. Let's hit the gym. Since we spend so many hours sitting at a desk, maintaining regular gym visit is really important for anyone working in an office. Got everything now, let's make this workout count. my one hour workout i feel so much better i'm so much more awake and i'm like really ready to start the day i'm just gonna be heading back home because i am in a, a little bit in a hurry i do need to start work latest 9 30 and it's already 9 when i finish workout i do need a 10 15 minutes drive to get home and just like open my computer get changed uh, take a like two minute quick showers so i'll hurry up and see you at home First, I start with my hair. For my hair, I just use some serum and my Dyson to keep it looking great. Taking good care of my skin keeps me refreshed and feeling good for the whole day. I like to accessorize to feel more put together for the day. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Rasha, a senior data analyst specializing in investment banking and based in Montreal. I create content about data analytics, career growth, and life in the corporate world. New videos drop every Sunday at 11 a.m. Eastern Time, so be sure to subscribe and stay tuned. Let's see what's on the agenda today. This is when I check my emails, scan my messages, review my task list. I order my task for the day to help me stay organized and focus on what's crucial. So guys, I was watching the videos that I filmed a little bit and I realized I look like a zombie so I am doing makeup right now just so I can like look more human and more awake for you guys. Um, currently, uh, I just finished having lunch and yeah, I'm doing my makeup. This morning was super busy. I had meetings. I had, we are also the beginning of the month. So what happens in the beginning of the month is I have a bunch of reports that need to be updated. And um, that's because I would automate them, but that's because it's like super high security level where I need to have 
um, I need to remotely connect to the virtual machine so I can access the data and refresh all these reports and the queries that run are really slow they take up sometimes like 30 minutes just to run but that's nice because I get like a little break as soon as like the query is running and I have a time I can like uh, respond to some messages I can look out for my email I can also a little bit scroll on TikTok uh, so that's nice. It's not all that bad. So guys, one important thing I want to talk about is how we work. It's uh, in an agile methodology way. This is really important because in an interview, you will be asked if you know this. You can actually just answer yes because it's nothing complicated and I'm going to tell you what it is. So agile methodology is the way we structure our workflow. So every week we have like meetings uh, for us it's like every two weeks a big meeting to plan a sprint so we work with like different sprints each sprint is like two weeks and every day we have a daily meeting just to see how our tasks are doing we also have epics so epics is when a project is really big and needs to be broken down into smaller projects so that's what epic is uh, i'm working on my third epic right now so it's like a big development project that's breaking down into like small tasks but like a lot of the time you'll also have all those small tasks that takes like a few days to finish epics takes like months to finish it's like bigger and we also have a retrospective where we can also rate uh, how the sprint was and see how we can improve for future future times and future sprints and future uh, agile planning uh, the softwares we use for this so the most popular one is DevOps but right now I'm using Jira both of them work the same way they're really good now that you guys know this like you guys are good like it's nothing complicated it's just the way how we plan our workflow so now you guys know and you guys are ready and if you guys get asked about have you worked in agile methodology or do you know what is agile methodology you can answer yes and you can think of um, jira and devops like the notion app so maybe you're familiar with notion i use it to plan my life and then um, devops and jira are basically the notion for your manager so that's like something really good to know and i also want to make every video that i post here educational so i am gonna always include some little bit of talking um, things that you guys should know things that will help you in the workforce or help you also land a job so let me know if you guys like that because i want to keep doing that for me when i watch a video i think it's very important that i also learn something from it so i also want to do that for you guys because i think it's really important and we can always grow and learn so much from each other So makeup is done. I feel so much better. Okay guys, since we're working from home, I am gonna do a quick desk tour just to show you a little bit of my setup. Okay guys, when we come in, there's a bunch of plants. Plants because I work so much from home, I do get depressed, so I need plants. This is my husband's side of the workplace. Uh, there's also another plant here, another plant here, another plant here. We also have a 3D printer here that we use. This is just like our, our fun like toy. Like we have fun with that. We just print a bunch of stuff, design a bunch of things. Uh, we are still in renovation. <clears throat> so we are missing this door and this door. Uh, this is where I used to film everything. This is my workspace. I like it. It's very cozy. Actually today I printed, I know, I know we're late. I know I am very late. But I printed some vision board for 2025 just to motivate me. So I just want to be more feminine, take care of myself, skincare. I want to be more adventurous. Um, I want to really work hard. I want to keep learning, get educated. And also this is new, but I added content creation because I want to make more content for you guys. And hopefully we can reach a nice community. I have here more plants. 
and we have a whiteboard here that I use when I study and right now it's being used to plan our trip to Japan which has been an all-time dream for me and my husband so if you guys want to also maybe see content about that let me know in the comments below I might just make some content about that I think it would be really fun for you guys to see our sprint meetings is where we share updates on our task we discuss any blockages or issues we're facing. If anyone is facing blockages or issue, the team is here to help. We ensure that we're all on track and clear on our objective for the day. So you guys know what is an epic since we went over it a little bit earlier in the video. I don't need to explain it again. And from that epic, I am just attacking a few tasks. And they consist uh, more in the beginning so I am doing a deep data analysis I am cleaning the data I am making sure it's relevant to organize everything documenting everything is crucial for continuity and transparency I document our processes and findings and review them before sharing this ensures that the entire team can rely on the information for future reference and ongoing projects and in case something happens or I'm not here. So they can refer to those documents and make sure um, of the continuity of the projects. I am done for the day.